<clears throat> Hello everybody, uh, welcome to another uh, Ride Along with Goggles tutorial. And today we're going to do, uh, trying to get, you know, trying to coordinate and get a um, a convoy going. I've got my good friend uh, C500 on the line. Say hello. Hey everybody. Yeah, you'll recognize him from, uh, we did a bunch of uh, convoys with Recon. Anyway, so what we're going to do, we've been in uh, convoy with this mod order before, but uh, it's been a while since we've been together. And what we're going to do is re-coordinate, get the files all up to date. That's uh, a pretty big mod order. Uh, C500 has, did you say 70? 71. 71. And since we last uh, used these profiles, I have added... 10 mods just testing and messing around with stuff and some of them uh, c500 is going to want to use because he hasn't used them before and is looking forward to it like the uh, drivable ai and maybe do a little pilot car run or something together later but anyway what we're going to do the way we're going to start off is we're going to go through our mod list and um, i've got 10 more than c500 so i'm going to read mine off from top to bottom He'll stop me when he doesn't have something. We'll decide if we're going to leave it in and uh, he's going to get it or I'm going to just delete it or take it out rather. So um, without further ado, this is uh, getting a convoy to work uh, 101. So uh, I'm going to read off from the top. Uh, I've got the Hell Creek Ranch, Bart Wilson with 30 option. Cape don't have that one. Okay, so that's the one from... Uh, Trucky. So okay. we'll, so what we can do is uh, we'll, we can come back. Do you want to just make a quick note and we'll come back to it? Or so we can yep. run through the list and then so we don't keep everybody as we go in and out. And sure. then it, when yep. we're done, we'll pause. We'll get everything together and then we'll try it again. Yep. Okay, so, so, we got a, yeah, so we got a note of that. And then we got the Dallas High Resolution Skybox. I've got that one. Yep. And next up, you probably don't have, is the drivable AI. Nope. Okay, make a note. Okay. No, uh, no limits mod version 1.3 for special transport DLC. Don't have that one either. Okay. Uh, do you have uh, Morgan Freeman? I do. Okay, realistic mirrors. Yep. Triples and doubles. Sound fixes. Yep. Is a uh, version twenty three point zero zero. Yep. Okay. Kenworth interior in effect. Yep. Peterbilt interior in effect. Yep. Weather in effect. Yep. Road and wind. Yep. Uh, it's version G four. Yep. Uh, air brake sound mod. Yep. Uh, big cam deaf and engine. Yep. C fifteen deaf and engine. SCS Lowboy Trailer, no cargo. Yes, sir. Okay, Real Eaton Fuller. Yep. Uh, custom Steering Wheel. Yep. Uh, we got uh, Buffy. Yep. Uh, Real Logos. Yep. Heavy Cargo. Yep. Challenger. Yep. Uh, Case Magnum 380. Uh, yes. Case Axial Flow. IH quad track. Yep. John Deere seven R. Yep. Uh, that was for Prestige. The next one is yep. SCS. Yep. John Deere eight R. Yep. Nine six ninety five sixty RT. Yep. Uh, S six hundred combine. Yep. Big Bud six hundred. Yep. Big Bud four fifty. Yep. Uh, SCS low boy banners. Uh, custom trailer mud flaps. Yep. Undermount trailer cables for base game trailer. Yep. Uh, SCS custom lights for the low boy. Yep. Hell Creek FLX 359. Yep. Now here's um, where I've added one from Steam. I just make a note. It's the Hell Creek Ranch skin for John Ruta's W900. Uh, you won't have the one specific to me or? No. Uh, Oh, I updated yours, and uh, I oh. made, like the one I made for you quite a while ago was done in a hurry. I fixed it all okay. up, 
and I'll send that to you, okay? And we'll yep. we'll get your um, your version as well. Okay. So so below that you would have had uh, the Hell Creek Ruta 389, Dan. Uh, below that I have the Hell Creek Ranch Ruta 389, Grant. Grant. Then then Darren, then Dan. Okay. I'll move uh, Grant up and then. All right. Okay, let's see if I got it right here. Oh. Okay, okay, and after that, the below that, um, Hell Creek, Ruta 389, Dan, below that, what do you have? Uh, Black Cherry for W900. Okay, so, where did, sorry, where did you have your uh, W900? Uh, at the top of the, so I have four Hell Creek Ranch. Okay. One W nine hundred and three three eighty nines. Okay, All right. So we're going to get you. There'll be five because I'm going to add the steam one so I can run it. Okay. Yep. So we'll come back to that. So black cherry. Yep. Multicolor. Uh, yep. Night moves. Yep. Uh, ten skin paint job pack for the Viper. Yep. Nova custom logging. Yep. Cabin accessories for Viper. Yep. yep. Custom parts. Uh, for Viper, yeah. Yeah, and now we're going to have, uh, did you get the updated Bart's uh, trailer stuff? No, I don't okay. have the Bart stuff. Okay, so what do you have there, Bart's 1.5 or something, light pack? I don't have anything for Bart's, I didn't oh. get that. Oh, okay, trailer. yeah. Oh, okay, so we're going to need that. So um, make a note of the Bart stuff. We'll come back yeah. to it. Uh, truck and trailer flare pack. Uh, yep. Okay, and you got the updated stuff for Ruta, right? Uh, which update? Oh, well, what version do you have right now of the truck and trailer flare pack? Uh, oh, yes, that's the, that should be the latest one. Yep. 7.0 or something? Uh, let me check here. 10.0? Oh, 10.0, so I got to update mine. Okay, so that's on me. Uh, okay, 24.5 wheel pack. Oh, just a sec. Because I, I have to update uh, mine. I probably didn't do it in this profile yet. So, uh, truck flares and trailer. Yeah, okay. Yeah. 10.0? Uh, uh, yeah, I just got to put it in here. Sorry, just a half a sec. Okay. Okay. Yeah, so after the trucks and trailers, the 24 and a half inch wheel pack. Yeah, 24.5. Trucks and trailers wheels. Yeah, let's see what version they're running there. I've got 6.0, so i got to update that too. i got 7.0, yeah. Yeah, I'll update that. So it's on me at the end of this little run here. Uh, Smarties. Yep. Alcoa wheels. Yep. Farm accessories pack. Yep. Sissels. Root is hopper bottom. Yep. His flatbed. Uh, not the flatbed. I can put that in real quick though. Okay. Oh, that's just flatbed. Okay. Is that version that. six point one? The which? Six point one. Or what version? Uh, sorry. Yeah. Uh, uh, that will be six point one. Yeah. Okay. Uh, logging trailer pack. Uh, 1.44, yeah. Yeah, and then Wilson trailer livestock. Yeah. And now below that, we're going to add three uh, BART trailers when we get to the end of the list and we go on pause for everybody. Okay. So that's where they'll go. Then I've got a couple Mac step decks uh, files from BART. We don't need to put those in if you don't have it. Uh, Viper 389. Uh, the Ruta uh, Highway Killer, there's four files. Yep, one, two, three, four, yep. And then we got, uh, I think, five for the Pete 389. Yep. And then we've got Montana Expansion Assets, uh, Project Farm Ranch Rebuild, and Montana yep. 2.0. Okay, yep. so what I'm going to do, so I just want everybody to realize, like, what we just did is we're, we're going to coordinate the files we have, 
and this is how we've done it. So now I'm going to go uh, pause the video while Grant and I sort it all out. Oh, C500 and I sort it all out. And then we're going to um, come back or run through it real quick. It'll all be the same. And then we're going to go from there, try and start the convoy and see if we get any issues or conflicts or things that we need to sort out because that's kind of the tricky part is actually getting the darn thing to run. So uh, we'll be back in a little bit and uh, see you soon. Uh, I just just jumping in here real quick with something that we may have missed in the video. So I'm, I'm I recorded this after and I'm just plugging it in here real quick because you're going to see us talk about a couple files in here that um, we weren't getting a match on. And so I put them on Discord for uh, C500 and then we got a mismatch out of that. So then I went and I downloaded them. So I had exactly the same ones. And I'm going to show you real quick what happens there. So I've since brought these files back down. Now let me just look real close. If I got a different file I could look at. Yeah, so that one's got underscores. So if you look at a file's information and you don't see underscores, that means that this file has never been dragged across um, applications or, you know, if you, if you email it to somebody or if I was to take this mod that I got from Truckee and drag it into Discord, when the, the other guy gets it, it's going to put underscores here between each word. And the underscores look like this. So you'll see now because I took this skin straight from Mod Studio onto my PC and it looked like this here with no underscores. When you go in and the actual game file that you see in your mod folder, not the mod manager, this is what's in your mod folder underscores. So the game is going to reject that. So even though you've both got exactly the same skin, these underscores are going to ruin it for you. So what we did in this case in the video, you're going to see, um, I went and I downloaded them from Discord. So I dragged them onto Discord, Grant uh, C500 downloaded them. And then I in turn after we had a problem, I went and downloaded and replaced the ones I have. So now I have underscores. So check that really carefully that if your skin's got underscores or not. And um, so here's another one. This one has never been shared. This is my personal Hell Creek SCS 3D9. It's never been shared. And I've never dragged it onto, you know, Discord or anything. So it has no underscores. So just bear that in mind when you're looking at the problems. And you can also, if you want, instead of doing that upload download thing, there's an alternative. Let's see if I can get this captured here. Uh, if I go to mod and let's go to Hell Creek. And we're in the Hell Creek Ranch. Uh, here, see? Oh, here's some Hell Creek Route of 380 Grant. See, this has underscores. You could, if one of these was the problem up here, like Hell Creek Ranch SCS 389 Dan, so that's a personal skin. It's never been on Steam or anything. And if I dragged that into Discord and C500 grabbed it so I could use it, so we both have the skin, he doesn't need to use it, but I want to. So I share it with him. And mine doesn't have underscores, his does. So I can either download it from where I put it for him, or I could just come in here and put underscores under it in between each word. So that's the alternative. So, But they have to match right down to that. And the other thing is the file size. They have to be exact or else the game will reject it. So just throwing that in there. I'm going to uh, stop this and uh, send you back to um, uh, C500 and I getting this uh, mod order working. So I just wanted to clear that up. Uh, thanks and uh, carry on. Okay, well, we're back. So that took a little while because we got a lot of mods in these mod folders. And uh, there was a few things that C500 had to get. And there was a few things I had to get. 
and also remove. Now, one little tip here, I had the uh, Mac step deck from BART and C500 doesn't have that mod. So I had to go into the game and sell that trailer and then take it out of the mod folder. You never take anything out of your mod folder uh, that's a mod, uh, if it's a truck or trailer or anything like that, without selling it. You got you got to sell it and then come back or else you'll get errors. I'll cause a mess. So what we're going to do now, we've run through the list. We've got the same mods in the same order. We're going to uh, exit out. So we're going to close out of the game entirely and exit the mod manager. And I guess E500 is doing the same thing. We're closing the game entirely. Yep. Yeah. And we're going to go to our home screen when we get there. Uh, here we go. And right click on American Truck Simulator. Go Properties. Local Files. And we're going to verify the integrity. As we found, like, if you don't do this, like, it's almost pointless. You're going to have to come back and do it at some point. And so if you both do this, or all the people involved in your... Uh, convoy um, oh and while this is verifying I want to stress that we have we have a, a lot of files here a lot of mods and uh, I highly recommend that if you're going to do this you uh, start with um, just a few mods like you know f pick something in common you can use like the Viper from Steam or my Viper from my Discord you know, the couple of files to mod it, the accessories, whatever, or the Overfloater K100 if you want a mod truck that easily works between uh, players. Keep it simple. Uh, if you're using uh, Zmod sound files, grab the Zmod sound files from Steam, like his Airbrake mod and Interior Effects, whatever you want. Get the ones from Steam. That Get as much of the mods that you're going to use from Steam as you can. And start simple. Establish your... Uh, your uh, game, make sure it's going to work. And when it does, uh, you can start adding things if you want, but add, add it in a coordinated fashion. And don't do what I did here, where I messed with this uh, profile a whole bunch. <laughs> and if you guys get a working profile, keep it going. Uh, keep keep it um, intact. And you can you, you know go back to it every week or however often you want to convoy. But anyway, um, C500, I'm almost done validating here. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm done. I just uh, went back into the game. I'll start up the convoy so that then you can show the folks There's. what it looks like. Yeah, exactly. So, well, fingers yeah. crossed, no errors. <laughs> yeah, well, so what happens, guys, is uh, quite often, you know, we may have a version mismatch or something, and we'll see an error, so... Uh, in this case, C500 is going to start the uh, convoy. If he does that, um, you'll get to see the error on my screen. You saw in that uh, load order set out, or sorry, uh, start that I was missing the BART step deck and customer file, and that was because I went in and sold it. So I'd get down to 78 mods to match uh, C500. So because the trailer came out and has all those cargos and everything else, the, the content change detected, updated navigation data. That's what that's all about. All right. So now uh, we'll go to convoys. And uh, do we have a convoy up, uh, C5? Just starting. Okay. Uh, what's it called? RD Trucking. Okay. Boy, we've got a lot of convoys going on. Wow. Huge. Lots of them with uh, no players. 
some with eight. There's that big daddy USA guy that always has a billion going. Oh, still not seeing it. Does it show up on your end? Uh, yep. Huh. Yep, it's running. I'll hit refresh again. Read it. Oh, of course. There. Oh, it's red. Okay. Well, let's find out what's red. So this is... So here's our convoy I'm trying to join. We got a red icon. We got to figure out why. So we'll go over to the right hand list and we're going to look down and see the uh, it's the mod compatibility that we're going to have a problem. OK, trucks and trailers flare pack not found local. And that's on uh, that's going to be, I think, C500. Oh, wrong version. Hell Creek Ranch route of 389. OK. Absent on servers, trucks and trailers flare pack. Okay. Errors, mod mismatch. So we really got uh, three problems, truck and trailer flare pack, or four. Well, no, three problems, the truck and trailer flare pack. So I'll show you what we're going to do. We're going to go and we're going to share these files because these are um theory is that you know and obviously like uh c500 and i both have our own purchases of the john ruta stuff so for the truck and trailer flare pack we can share that and for this hell creek ranch ruta 389 uh that's going to be um what we're going to do is i'm going to share those so i'll show you how we're going to do it so C500, I'm just going to close out of here. I guess you can, you'll have to kill that too. I'm going to exit to the launch pad. C5 can do the same. Then we're going to... So I'll just, sorry to jump in there. I'll just huh? grab the one that I already shared with you. Yeah. And put do, it in my for, for the flare pack. Yeah, you do that. And then I'm going to share the two skins. So what we're going to do, if we go to our Discord that we're on, which is here, and so C500 shared this with me because it's got it's uh, newer than the one I downloaded. I went to log into my Ruta uh, account and I, for whatever reason it's not working today, which is I think he's been having problems. So he C500 sent me his, and what happens is you get an underscore. And what he can do now is he can download the same one and then ours are going to match. And I have two skins for the Ruta 389. And I think they're going to be these two right here. And they were causing an error. So I'm going to send them to him. And then he'll have the same version that's in my uh, mod folder. And so we put those in. Like in theory, that's going to take care of our uh, mismatches. And I'll, uh, I'll stay handy with the mod order here just in case we have uh, something funny going on. Oh, where were those right here? All right. Was, oh. Yeah, you had both 389s. Oh, there was, oh, I don't know. I wonder if it was, a, there's three of them and only two are causing an error. You know what? Three of the 389s? Two of the 389s, I have three in the, yeah. I bet you it was, um, I know what I gotta do, hold on. I probably sent you. You sent me yours and recons. Oh, okay, if you did that, that's good. Those are the ones we need. Okay. As far as I can tell, we'll find out soon enough. Yeah. Two shakes here and all. Yeah. And you'll be still at 78 mods. Yes. Yeah. 
Okay, I'm going to pause the video for a second until we get the convoy up, and then we'll look again. Okay, so we're back. We did that, and we still we're still red. So we got to figure out what happened, guys. Um, wrong order. Oh, that's not. Oh, Hell Creek Ranch wrong version for Hell Creek Ranch Ruta. I wish they'd give us more information. So how many Hell Creek Rutas do we have? Three. Well, sorry, five. Uh, but it's Hell Creek Ranch Ruta is the name. And there's two of them. I only see two because I see Hell Creek Ruta 389. But I see two that are Hell Creek Ranch Ruta 3838. And it's still uh, calling the truck and trailers flare pack a mismatch. I think that's uh, going to require a... Uh, a um, verify. One? verify, yeah. I wonder if that's... What's going on here with these uh okay guys well anyway we know what the problem is here or what they're saying this problem is and uh, we're going to just pause the video again and run out and fix this and probably verify and come back see what happens back in a bit okay everybody we're back and after so what we did was you saw how i moved those two skins to the discord and c500 grabbed them from there and it gave us an error, so I went and grabbed them uh, from the Discord as well. So I had exactly the same, you know, the, the two systems can't see them differently because they were from the same source. Even though, you know, they both came from me, they went to uh, C500 and it still complained. We also went and did a file verification, but now we've got a, it's yellow, which is great. So that means we can easily fix the problem. So we're going to click on it. And it's probably going to be a mod order or something, wrong order. So the flare pack is in the wrong place and that's it. So activate session mods is our option here. We didn't have this before because it was claiming the two skins were in error. So I'll just go activate session mods. And, uh, and we'll just say confirm mod activation in here. Would, if, you, if you went, we could probably compare and see where the where it's got a, it thinks the order's wrong. It is, see here? We got these two out of sync. So, no big deal. Confirm mod activation. It'll switch them around. And, uh, or if it doesn't switch them around, it ignores it. I'm not sure of the nuts and bolts of how that it works. But anyway, we're going to be in convoy here right away. And that's how you do it. So, you know, and that was with an extreme number of mods. So, I mean, that's like almost your worst case scenario. But we had had that convoy working before. So uh, it's just uh, fetching sessions here. Here we are. We got our green light. And I'm going to join the convoy. And do we have a password? Oh, here, hang on. I'll put on uh, pause for a sec. Yeah, I didn't uh, want to put All it right. There. So uh, I got the password here from uh, C500. And you're and, yeah, we're in. So the thing is, you don't often. So now we show here's our uh, session. And uh, yeah, it's awesome. We're good to go. So, oh, we got a good um, latency between us 22 milliseconds. That's good. So if we went to the map, I'd probably f find uh, C500 on here somewhere. Probably down, down in Texas. There he is. So we just got to sync up and have some fun. So guys, that's really how you do it. Like it can be, uh, seem like a pain in the neck. You're never going to get there, but just remember files that you can share, share, and you, uh, for pay mods, make sure you vote, you, you've got the same version of the pay mods. In a lot of cases, all you got to do is log back into the guy's site. Like if it's, uh, Bart's or John Ruta or, FLX or, um, you know, any of the mod guys, KSW, whoever, log back in with your account. Make sure you've both got the, uh, get the, or both or all members of your convoy have the latest and greatest and um, uh, non-pay things. 
uh, and I guess with pay things like, you know, it's a, I don't, it's not much of a gray area. I don't think if you both have, like we had with the flare pack, we had a different version of the flare pack, but we both bought the mod. And so we just got synced with that right there. And, um, you know, skins from steam or wherever, or if you share them privately amongst yourselves that you've created, no worries. And, um, your best bet is always use steam mods because the steam mods, uh, are, uh, synchronized through steam updates. And when you start your game and everything else, it'll synchronize them or update you. So it's the easiest to get going with them. And, uh, there you go. So that's kind of getting a convoy going one on one, and um, actually maybe a little more than that with the complexity of what we were doing. But thanks for following along, and uh, we'll catch on the next one. And uh, say goodbye, C500. Adios. Have a good one. <laughs> there we go. Okay. Ciao. Take care, guys. Mm -hmm.